Greetings Bio 111 students. In this video I'm going to show you how to calculate the rate of the reaction for the cellular respiration lab. As you can see I've got my data all set up and I've clicked on a cell underneath the data for CO2 production for the glucose carbohydrate that was added to the yeast. So I'm going to calculate that rate. You can follow this exact same procedure for all of the other uh, carbohydrates. So you go up to the insert function button and just click on that and it's going to ask you to search for a function. You can just type in slope there because that's what we're calculating. Or if it's already available because you've used it before, just double click on that and it'll open that function up. So your instructor may ask you to, gra or to calculate the rate for a different range of values. I'm just going to do it for the entire range of values for both sets for the in set of data. So for our known Ys, we're going to select all of the CO2 data in the column. For the X's, we'll select all of the time period, so all the way to 20 minutes. And then we'll just click on OK, and there's your rate. Now remember, the units of your rate are milliliters of carbon dioxide per minute. That's how you calculate the rate for the cellular respiration lab.